Hello, it's Jason Payne for Cold Banker, Dean Hop Realtors. Well, today I'm a brand new community, the community called the Farmhaus, spelled in German, H-A-U-S. Uh, I really like this community for a couple of reasons. One, they're all certified for being able to use Airbnb. So if you're looking for an investment property, and of course if you want to come to town every once in a while, but most time Airbnb it, this is a great opportunity and the location. We are just one mile from the Creekside area where I like to call Buckyville. So if you're driving down 35 and you see the Buckies, we're kind of just on the other side of uh, Buckies. So uh, yeah, let's stop talking. Let's start showing this house. Out. Now, as you can tell, these are uniquely built houses, but wait till we get inside. They are absolutely gorgeous inside. They're not the biggest houses, they're not the biggest lots. So they also cater to like those young professionals. People are wanting to be, uh, uh, close to New Braunfels, but don't need a big house, some high maintenance yard. You can see there are already people living in these houses. Yes, those are one car garages you see, but yeah, the inside of the house is absolutely gorgeous. Uh, we are like located right off 35 and you have a hospital close by, lots of entertainment close by. Uh, Canyon High School is real close, but yeah. Just pay attention to the amenities as we come in and we have a special guest. Let's head on inside. All right, coming into the front door, make sure you hit that like button. That does really help a lot. Well, let's check out this home. We have one of our fellow Coal Banker agents, Miss Alita here. Um, she's kind of helped um, selling these houses. She is here every weekend holding these houses open. So definitely stop by and say hi to her. Miss Alita, please introduce yourself. Yes, she speaks fluent English too. She's just showing off that she's bilingual. <laughs> so don't hesitate to come in here. She is English speaking as well, but that is really neat skill to have. So if you're watching these videos and you're looking for someone who's uh, habla espanol, feel free to reach out to Miss Alita. I'm gonna leave her contact information in the description box. All right, let's talk about this house. Um, see if they mention the farmhouse. This is what they're talking about. They're kind of carrying up a very popular theme right now in Texas, the farmhouse look. These houses are right around 2,000 square feet, so they're not the biggest houses. Now I talked about the location. Uh, this is the Creekside Shopping Mall. All that's within one mile of this community, which I also like call Buckyville. You got the hospital right there. Bucky's is kind of off to this side. Lots of shopping, academy, Best Buy, uh, restaurants, entertainment, all right there. These are some of the lots that are still available. This is what uh, this house does look like when it does have full furnishing in it. So you can see it's really good use of space. And a little bit more about the Creek House and more of this, the Creekside community. All right here, this is a really popular and growing entertainment district. Uh, there's the farmhouse community, and right over here is Fry Height, one of my favorite uh, live mu music venues. Uh, they play a lot of Texas country music and amazing hamburgers. So yeah, there's a lot going on in this location. If you want to be in the heart of everything, and we are just two miles away from downtown New Braunfels, including like Landa Park and everything else. That's why this is such a wonderful place if you're doing an Airbnb. All right, let's check out this kitchen. This is a gas community. So they got a really nice Whirlpool gas cooktop. Um, beautiful backsplash of these, the people who built this house really put a lot of attention to higher end uh, finishes. The microwave, it's, now if y'all been watching my video, y'all know, know I like to push the button and have it slide open. Well, that's not that. But you can easily pull this microwave out and put one of those top loaded microwaves in. And it's not that crazy expensive to do, but that's what I would recommend if you were to buy this house. Uh, refrigerator space kind of tucked this way in the side, a little spot for your coffee, but definitely a really nice deep sink. Nice sink area, place for your patio. Miss Lita, where's the pantry at? The pantry is right here. All right, here's the pantry. 
Alrighty, so I always want to show off the pantry to folks. There it is. So like I said, remember if it's geared to a younger professional person, doesn't have that big family, you really don't need that big of a pantry. All right, let's check out the backyard. So you got a really nice little patio space to sit in. These aren't the biggest of lots, but a lot of folks, especially uh, those young professionals who got their first nice job in this area, yeah, let's be honest, they don't like to mow very much. So this, this house might be a really good fit for it, or if, like I said, if you're running this as an Airbnb, you don't want to spend a whole lot on lawn maintenance. So uh, yeah, that's why it's not a big lawn. All right, let's go ahead and head on upstairs. So there are two bedrooms upstairs, and the master bedroom is downstairs. And I hope you stick around to see that because it is really beautiful. This is going to be your washer and dryer hookup. They went really high end on the flooring. This is a beautiful wood flooring on here, and these stairs, they really uh, went all out on these really nice hardwood stairs going up. All right, coming up here, you have a nice little storage closet where you can use it for whatever you're doing for storing, attic access, all of your electricals. And here's, like I said, the one of the two bedrooms for upstairs. Let's check out their closet size. Not a bad closet size there. <coughs> this is gonna be the shared bathroom for these two upstairs rooms. Like I said, perfect situations for Airbnb. A lot of the Airbnbs around here can be like old condos. So if you're coming to Texas and uh, you want a little bit nicer place that's not 50 years old, yeah, this is a really good option. Because, <clears throat> yeah, these are brand new. There we go. All right, let's head on back downstairs and check out the master bedroom. Because, they yeah, the bathroom's super nice. All right, we are back downstairs. Got another little closet here. So this would be a perfect place if you were using the Airbnb to put your luggage, tuck it away, and have easy access to it. But yeah, the master bedroom, really good size. Here's a little picture of what it looks like fully furnished. Yeah, and there's a little sneak peek of the bathroom, which is right here. They really went all out on the tile in here. And uh, I haven't mentioned the price of this because right now they're asking right around $500,000 for it. I wanted to hold off and show all the high-end details, like the little pocket door here, um, that they've put into this house before I mention the price. We well, yeah, have freestanding tub. These are not cheap to put in. Trust me, I've talked to a lot of builders. That's a nice upgrade. Every piece of hardware they've put in here is a, a really higher end upgrade in uh, other builders. But yeah, here's your master bedroom closet. And then check out this shower. I carry the same tile throughout and just slid it in and a beautiful top shower with the step in it, or bench. Very nicely done. Like I said, very high end uh, features in this house. Small house, conveniently located to everything you want to be in New Braunfels and all high end finishes. So uh, yeah, if you, this definitely geared into those young professionals and potential Airbnbs. There are other plans that are coming along to be available. So if you're looking in this area, feel free to stop in and talk to Miss Alita. Here's a quick look at what the prices are. As I'm filming this, it's early August 
2023, so prices are changing um, all every day. There's some of the four plans. But uh, yeah, if you got any questions, uh, yeah, feel free to say hi to Miss Alita here. Just come on by. Thank you. All right, that's going to do it for the tour of the farmhouse community in the Creekside area, or like called Buckyville's, part of New Braunfels. We're just off I-35. Remember, two miles from everything you want to be at in New Braunfels, and one mile from all the shopping and Bucky's and all that other good stuff and entertainment that Creekside has to offer. If you like this video, feel free to hit that like button. Of course, I want you to share these videos with your friends and family. All right, oh yeah, don't forget to subscribe. All right, take care now, bye.